Hey guys, Shadows here, and today within this video we're going to be looking at the combo weapon known as the mini chainsaws. Yes, they're mini, but you get to get two of them, so this is a great combo weapon to use. As you can see guys, the blueprint or today it is a side mission, however, is located here in the bottom leftish area of Sunset Hills. As you can see guys, as you enter the basement of this restaurant there, as you can see the side mission is also known as Bite the Ball. And you meet this guy called Ravi, the survivor, who's locked himself away from everything, the zombies, the survivors, the psychopaths, just to give himself a bit of alone time. But he's actually found a blueprint, guys, and he wants you to find the two items so he can build it himself. The two items are a meat cleaver, which is just located here in the kitchen area of the restaurant at the top of the building. And you also need to find a chainsaw. So you want to go all the way through the restaurant, guys, where everyone did dine before they got munched up into zombies. You want to actually exit the building, jump over this truck right here, and also jump over the wall. Because the chainsaw, guys, as you just saw a glimpse there, is located on the balcony above Nick right now. So you want to take a right, guys. You could go left, but just to be safe, guys, you want to take a right and follow the exact same path I do in this video. Go up all these stairs. Yes, there's like three stories of stairs. And then you want to turn around, guys, and actually enter the house right here with the balcony so you can get to the chainsaw there may be a few zombies in your way so why not let's chop them up but go past this survival training here guys and on the left is the chainsaw that we require once you've got both items guys you want to return to Ravi and tada as you can see guys he actually makes the combo for you once you hand over both items and after he finishes rambling on about how scared he is the actual blueprint pops up and that's when it's confirmed to be accessible for all times. So let's have a look at the mini chainsaw combo weapon in action. So as you can see guys the heavy and basic attacks are a very very fast reflex which definitely is always good when coming against them zombies in that tight situation. But also guys if you take a look at the heavy attack it's definitely a slice and dice by always chopping off them heads but it also takes on as many zombies more than one at a time with each attack. So today guys I'm going to be giving a combo rating of 8 out of 10 because this weapon is very very useful but until next time guys I will see you on the next one.